All right, welcome back to another episode of Finding a 50. If you're just tuning in, I'm on the hunt for a wild 50 centimeter Australian bass. And so far we've got a 40, a 45 and a 48. Uh, we're back at the system where I first started, where I shot the first episode. Water is a lot lower than then. Uh, we've had a little bit of rain just the, early this morning. I was meant to be out a couple of hours earlier, but a big cell came through and it wasn't really meant to start raining until tomorrow. So I know the fish would probably be clued into that and I'm hoping that they're gonna feed up just before we get these few days of rain. Anyway, I'm floating down the river. I've just hit my first little set of rapids and hopefully we don't know capsizes today, but we've got a bit more river to cover. We've launched a bit higher up in the system and the car's up there. My brother was meant to come with me and he slept in. So I've got no car to pick me up downstream, but once I get down there, I might just give him a call and see if he can come and pick me up and bring me back up to my car. So I'm gonna try and go a bit further down the system, probably cover about 10 k's of river today. Fish the same spots that we fished last time and a lot of new spots as well. So hopefully, there's some good action and we can maybe get even get the 50 today frog in here try and get it right up under these um overhangs and stuff the water is a little bit dirty after that rain but i don't think it's too dirty well it's definitely not too dirty because it was a lot dirtier oh big big boil there oh Big bass there, Jesus. Saw him come up that one. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. That was a big fish. Just missed the frog. Holy hell. Holy hell, he detonated on that. I got the heart going. Snagless. Oh my god! Again! Oh. Do a bit more walking in the rapids this time, I think. <laughs> This is where I actually started last time and still throwing the frog it's actually it was actually the Sun sort of came out for a bit there and now it's gone back overcast so hoping we can get a maybe a good top water bite throughout the day Come on, come on. That was a big fish. Oh, I've missed four fish now so going back to the pompadour a bit more hook exposure and see if we can get one and land one now oh Oh! 
Oh my god. What are these going on? That was another big bass there. <gasps> That's five now. That one missed the pompadour. They're just not committing to it. I actually got a good look at that fish too. Oh. Well, at least they fired up. Be nice to land one. All right, well, I haven't had even another touch in that hole and I'm coming up to the rapid now. This is the rapid that I actually capsized on in that first episode. But the water's a lot lower now, so I should be right. I'll probably get out and walk it just to be safe. Don't want to find that hook. Ah. Oh. So I had that one hit in this pool. Got another set of rapids coming up now. So I'll go through them and then I'm going to pull over and probably do a bit of rigging, maybe take off the top water. I don't know. I love a top water bite and I really just want to get one off the top. I've missed, I think, six, six or seven now. So. I don't know. I'll do a bit of rigging and maybe charge some batteries and stuff. And I'll see you in the next pool. So, so I've just pulled over at this little rapid here, doing a bit of rigging, taking the top water off. I've gone, I've got the chatterbait still on the other rod and I've gone just to a little three inch slim swim with a jig spin on this rod. Just to see if it's like something smaller, they can get it in their mouth. They've been like coming up eating like you would have seen. They're just missing, missing the top water. I haven't had a hit on the chatterbait yet, so this is one of my go-tos. I know it's a bit small, like I'm targeting big bass, but hey, any bass is better than no bass. So rig up, got the batteries recharged, or changed over batteries, have a drink of water, and then I'll get back into it. Let's go. I am going to land a bass. I'm about halfway through, about halfway through the, the um, the river where I'm getting out, so I'm gonna land one. I'm gonna get one soon. Hopefully in this next pool. All right, so all the fish have been feeding. right at the start of these pools so we're sort of in with our best shot now while we're still sort of in a bit of rapidy water so they seem to be 
Oh, I hit them. <laughs> Didn't feel big. This is a good pool we're coming into now. It's where I got the second fish last time that I was here. So I'm really hoping for something. Oh! Missed him. On the chatterbait. That's another one to the tally. <laughs> Dead set. Can't win them today. Oh! <laughs> oh man, that was a good one. I watched him come up over that log. He didn't actually, didn't actually grab the lure at all. I just watched him come up over the log and missed it all. So they're a bit shy. Like I've been swiping at a lot of the lures. Like I've had a couple of them. I've had a couple of good top water bites that just missed, but a lot of the other ones have been just like. Swipes. Bummer. He wasn't a massive fish, but Jesus, it would be nice to just land. <laughs> to just land one. This was that bloody bit of bamboo that caught me out last time. Well, at least we can slip under it this time with no dramas. Here we go. Oh, that was a bit easy last time. Jesus, it's beautiful in here though. Just for context, this last time I just went straight over this. I didn't even know there was like a weir here. But look at that. Full weir and there's also dead looks like a bony brim. I didn't know there was bonies in here. Yeah, that's crazy. It shows you how much the water's changed. But I'm gonna have a little dip. Just run the head under, refresh a bit. Then head through onto the next, next hole. Oh, that's better. Tell you what, it's getting hot now that sun's come out. It's all new territory now. New water, hopefully it's a bit more productive than the last few bits. And, oh, wait, I've had me chances, don't get me wrong. I've definitely had me chances. The bass just seem to be, I don't know, they're definitely like fired up well they definitely were fired up this morning but well not much is happening my legs are getting roasted the day's getting on it's probably about one o'clock now and still got a couple of k's to go so oh, starting to lose a bit of confidence Oh my god, man. Missed another one. <laughs> oh, man. What is going on? Switch it over to the 
I've just got a little weedless three inch minnow. Just wanted something a bit bigger and weedless because I was getting snagged a bit. Still got the spinner blade on there, but missed two fish on it now. That one just felt like a good one then too. Don't know what's going on today. They're not really just properly eating. Oh yes! Oh, just there. Oh, just. oh man, I was about to get some footage of them. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Oh, there was two turtles up there. There was actually a water dragon on the turtle's back. And I was, I was like, oh, I'll, I'll get some footage. Oh, he's not a bad one. And I was like, oh, I'll get some footage of him. They're gone now. And I just paused it for a second and it sunk down. And there we go. He'd be a 40. Oh, man, I've missed so many fish. Switch it up to that spinner bait. Oh, the jig spin with a three inch minnow. You know. And finally, I've just, I've just had a few bites in this same sort of area, so it might be a little bite window coming on now. I'll get him back, he'd be around 40. Oh, it's been a long day. It's about 2.30 now. I launched in at 6. So, I'm pretty burnt. Got my shirt covering my legs. So I don't get cooked. I've snapped one of my rods coming down the rapids. Ah, but that makes it a bit better. She's getting thick through here. Fish too. Oh. Yes. Oh. Oh, he's a nice fish. He's a nice fish. Come on, let's hop it up. There we go. Persistence. Jesus, we've missed some. Oh, he's a cracker. He's a he's a donk. Oh, persistence. We have missed so many. But two now. Two now as the Arvo gets on. I'm going to quickly give him, give this one a measure because he'd be up over the 45, I reckon. Not the 50, but definitely over 45, I'd say. Just a quick measure. What's that? Yeah, 45. 45 on the dot. No, oh, 45 and a half. He's a fatty. There we go. There we go. Woo! Jesus, I've missed a few. Right, oh, that's easing the pain. Just on that three inch minnow again. 
put it right up in the back there. I'm just targeting these little patches of shade in between the trees. Oh. And then if we caught every single one, or even half of the ones that I've had a chance at today, I would have caught a fair few fish, but I'm not complaining. That's a, that's a cracker. So I just grabbed the chatterbait off the other rod quickly because I couldn't be bothered grabbing my bag and rigging up. That was a big fish, man. That's 16 pound leader. That's the third time ever that I've been smoked by a bass. Wow. <sighs> Left a big boil too. Oh, I had one just come out on it then. Oh. I've gone back to the three inch minnow. That's uh, pinfish color. Got the jig spin on again. The last color I had was mud minnow, which I liked it because of the dirty water, but I don't have any more of them. Pinfish is great, good all rounder, clear, dirty, doesn't matter. I've got a 3 8 head in that one. The last one had a 1 4 just so I can get it down a bit. Cause it seemed like the fish, like that first one, I ate, it ate it when I was just paused and it was sinking. And the other ones, I really had to slow it right down to get them to bite. So this will keep it down a bit, for, this will keep it down a bit further. And Hopefully we can get one more. I think I've got one more hole to fish after this one as well, but I'm running out of batteries, running out of everything. I'm sunburned out as hell. So hopefully we can get a couple more. Pool left, running out of time, battery, memory card, everything. But we'll see if we can get at least one more. Some tight country. Real tight country, look at this. Full. Been dragging through this. Oh. Jesus. That's where the water probably was when I was in here last. <laughs> Bathtubs and all sorts of shit. Oh, 
now over the log. Far out. last pool what looks like this last pool now so I'm absolutely wrecked <laughs> yes oh, that's a good fish that's a good one oh, oh man he's gone Jesus, there's some brutes in here, eh? Just as we got in that pool, right in the headwaters. And that's a real nice fish. Fuck, they're thick at the moment. Oh. Oh, yes. Oh, I think he sprayed that lens up. Oh, I'll turn this camera off and... Oh, actually, I'll just hold him up. He's... On the pinfish. He's not the fitty. He's not even a 45. But he's he's easy 40. Three for the day. One bust off. We got a little bit left of this pool and not much memory card or battery. So getting back and try and get another. Oh, straight away, as soon as it landed. Oh, they're really coming on the sub. Oh, that's another nice bass. That's another ripper. Oh. oh my God, he'd be close to 44 of that one. Oh, the amount of times I thought about leaving today. I have bit off a bit more than I can chew. It's been pretty far. Wow, he'd be another 45er, maybe a bit bigger. On that pinfish again, give him a quick measure. Oh, he's only 43, but still. Oh, 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 oh. settled in. Get him back. Try and get at least one more, look at that. That's a brute. Wild river beast. Well, thanks for watching another episode. Just pulling the yak off now. Got my beautiful girlfriend coming to pick me up. Covered about 10 k's of river. And it's about five o'clock now. I launched in at six, so I was about 11 hours on the water. I bit off a bit more than I could chew. Looks all easy on maps. Once you get in there and start going through it, yeah, it was a bit of a mission. But persistence paid off because I, I had a few moments, especially after I snapped my rod, thinking, oh, just, just get out now. I've seen some spots to get out. And I thought, no, there's got to be something good at the end. And, and it was, it was great at the end here. And I'll be coming back to these holes. I'll probably launch in here and maybe go up towards them and try and get in for a surface bite here on another episode. But we won't stop until we get the 50. So we got the 240s, a 42 and a 45 today. And we're going for the 50. So if you like this, like, subscribe, all that shit. And I'll see you on the next one.